Yes, and this is for Feb 24th until 2nd of March. Now let's take a look what's going to be coming your way. Oh, Libra, you are moving. Somebody from the past is an air sign. Will also be coming your way. And an earth sign that you need to proceed with caution. <coughs> okay. Well, I feel like it's going to be a very sound week for you, Libra. Um, I don't see any betrayals or lies or pr troubles, but I feel like you will be more stronger emotionally. There is news that's going to be coming your way, and I feel like this is about a journey, or if you're currently applying for a visa or some documentations from the government or some airlines or whatever it is that you're trying to apply for or waiting for, in the form of news, it is going to be coming your way this week. And you are leaving or going on a travel. And I feel like this is the moment that you have been waiting for. If you are also looking forward to move or to relocate, you will have enough money to relocate or to move to a new place, new house, new apartment, new job, new desk, new de de department, or new team. Okay? So... There will be a, a uh, like a major transition or major, well, yeah, it's a major transition that's going to be coming your way, plus a lump sum of money or like a new job offer, plus an overseas uh, program. It's, uh, and it's and for those who's actually um, trying to apply for a scholarship abroad or for, for some overseas application, uh, you will also be getting the uh, you know the uh, the good news this week. Now, there is somebody from the past, which is another air sign, that you have been trying to avoid, and that you've been trying to you know protect yourself from. But this person will you know continuously communicate with you, call you, text you, email you, you know, uh, search you on social media and stuff like that. It is because that they want you back in their life. Meanwhile, if you're already with an earth sign. Things are slowly working between the two of you, but then the problem here is there is a disturbance or there is like a not really a third party because you know it's it, it's not that you're gonna be going for this air sign, but I feel like there will be a bit of a jealousy because the person that you're with is very possessive, um, traditional, conventional, insecure, possessive, and territorial. Okay. Which is you know what? In a, in a situation or in a relationship, it shouldn't be like territorial. But you are the only one who can uh, fence your relationship or protect or shield your, you know, your relationship away from this um, obsessed air sign. Okay? Now, and you're already having a hard time spelling out this person's behavior or attitude towards you because sometimes they're cold sometimes they're hot but sometimes they don't really care but sometimes they care too much you know it's like damn if you do damn if you don't and there's a part of you who just wanted to give up on this relationship but you feel like no you know we've already come a long long way and we've already gone through a lot of stuff and a lot of things and you know i feel like this is you know uh, this this too shall pass. You are trying to hold on to your faith, and you are trying to hold on to your, you know, to your stuff together, and to your relationship. But then, it, you know, it's it's actually not your fault. It's not like you're the one who reached out to this other person from the past, you know, to uh, you know to create or to shake up your your life again. They are the one who's been. Uh, reaching out to you nonstop and who's been trying to create some you know some nuisances and I feel like you need to 
think of more ways you know you don't really have to stress out yourself on how to secure this earth sign in your life but i feel like it is much better for you to start thinking more of how to make yourself happy okay because you've already given your everything you've already given most of the stuff that you really want to have and it's all the effect of your work now for those libras who is in the field of uh, limelight like show business media acting stage uh, i feel like there's an upcoming project that you can really expect coming your way and i feel like this is a minor thing but right after this minor you know right after this minor um project it will be followed by an offer that is going to be in, in you know internationally based now for those who is in the um earth industry or service industry you will be um getting an offer that's more likely moving let's say for example uh, like a tour or you're going to be um, working with people who's on the road or touring or traveling, you know. So this is the, you know, the perfect time for you to create some diversion or to have some time for yourself or to move away, you know, or to start thinking about where is this re relationship really going to go. Because you're, you know, you, it's like you're so full of confusion. You can't even think clearly while you're at work. You're, you're too confused and it's like your energy is, you know, like all over the place. It's too sporadic. All right. So money is going to come. Okay. I feel like this week you will have like a very great week for finances but when it comes to your love life when it comes to this you know it's it, it, sometimes you know your beauty comes like a curse because when you don't want somebody to be in your life they still keep on pushing and pushing and pushing you know and then when there are someone that you want they're the one who's pulling away from you so it's like you don't even know what to do anymore you know, you're trying to get close to someone that you really want to be with. But the person that you don't want to be with, they're the one who's like trying, cl you know, like uh, sticking around with you. So, I hope that this week you will figure out what you really want. Because there is a big offer or there is a big um, work opportunity that's going to be coming your way. But that entails some sacrifice that you have to make. And that is also something that you need to think about. Don't let the opportunity pass you by. All right. So anyway, that's it for you for this week, Libra. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website and sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.